Hi guys and welcome to this video. If you could like, share and subscribe to the channel, I would much appreciate it. Liking helps the algorithm, sharing gets in front of people's faces and subscribing shows me how much you like the content. And if you want to donate, there's a donate button or donate things are below and I'm looking into membership at some point in the summer. So we'll have something where the, the live monthly we, we, yeah, live stream for members and emoticons and stuff like that. I'm going to be looking more into that soon. But we're going to be talking about the good old transfer rumour mill that is Sheffield Wednesday Football Club. Sheffield Wednesday are looking along with Huddersfield and Barnsley at Kyle Hull, Hudlin, he currently at uh, Sully Hull Moors, but there is a little bit of a good thing in Wendy's approach here. Now, it, some of them may remember we were looking at Jimmy Shan, uh, the former Sully Hull Moor boss. At one point, they he worked with Darren Moore at West Brom, so he might be able to use some old contact contacts even, to say how he's the player, get to talk to him, find out a little bit more about him. If we did buy him, the 20-year-old outfield player is the tallest player in Britain at the moment. He's six foot nine. So people will be already calling him like the new Atty New Hero such. I've already seen people say that already. But it would be interesting to see what happens there? It would be nice to see if we could get a deal for him doing. Yes, both Huddersfields and Barnsley are in for him, but I do think if we went for him, we would maybe be looking at maybe get offered in 13 football kind of thing, going with that. And also, when they are still looking at Reese James at Doncaster Rovers. Now, the Rover boss, Richie Wellens, who just come in and said that it's in his court now he needs to make a decision but you need to be quick about it so they know where to move on the 27 year old would be a free transfer because his deal is set to a fire next month which would be good for us that we would only have to do wages moore's already worked with him at doncaster rovers and already said that he likes him as a good player says he's very um he's very adaptable and changeable, can change your position. And this is a position we must sort out because as it stands, the only recognised left back we had at the club was Matt Penny, who now left. And talking of uh, some of the players who have left with their contracts not being renewed, Matt Penny put a nice statement out. Tom Lee's method to the fans on the website I thought was lovely. Kieran Westwood has said his bit. We're all seeing all these thing come out now from X players. Uh, I thought Van Aken was very honest, very truthful. But that's what we were. Would you like us to go after the young 20 year old at Sully Hill Hull and start doing that kind of deal where we're going lower leagues and starting to do that? And something I've been wanting us to do for a while. Look at the lower league because there is really good talent there that either we shove in our under 20s under or under 23s or say, right, we're going to give you a chance at 13. Because you've got to remember, we got um, Hagen, I think that's how you say it, Hagen, um, who's been offered a pro deal and I'm guessing he's going to be looking to make a mark as well as the likes of Alex Hunt and Kieran Brennan. Jeffrey went they have also called their interest in Charlton Town defender Will Boyle. Uh, it thought that he suffered a serious knee injury over the Easter weekend, which makes sense. We don't want to be signing players who have got serious injuries and doing what we did a little bit with Dunkley. So we called our interest on Will Boyle. Let's see who else we look at at centre-back. But Personally, if he had got a serious knee injury, that makes sense to move on to other targets and see where else we could pick up a defender because we are needing defenders and we need to bolster that back lineup. So let's see what happens. Thank you for watching. Hit that like button, hit that share button, subscribe to the channel and stay here for more Wednesday content.